Good evening and welcome to 22 News at 11. The three Republicans seeking the Senate seat vacated by John Kerry met in a candidate's debate at City Stage in Springfield tonight. The format for the debate allowed for a brisk pace and interesting exchanges among the candidates. The three Republicans who want to be the next U.S. Senator from Massachusetts debated each other Thursday night at City Stage in Springfield. They agreed that Social Security needs to change so it lasts for generations while keeping it available to workers currently in or near retirement. We need to make sure that anybody who's receiving Social Security, anybody who's 55 and older, is protected, that they will have the benefit of the agreement that they made. I know we refer to it as an entitlement program. I like to refer to it as an earned program. People have invested in it and they deserve to have those uh, benefits and not uh, worry about it. Extending the, uh, the retirement age, you can do it in a slow, gradual way. You can actually increase it on one of the proposals by one month a year for 24 years. That's a gradual increase of two years over 25 years. None of the candidates seemed anxious to commit to building high-speed rail service between Springfield and Boston. I certainly wouldn't rule it out, but the same token, I wouldn't build a uh, high-speed train just for the sake of having railroad tracks. I think it's something that the community has to determine whether or not it's an effective way for purposes of transportation. If the people of Massachusetts, the people of Western Massachusetts feel that this is exactly what they need and it fits within my two principles that I just outlined, then I would support it. But if it doesn't, then I wouldn't support it. We can't just spend more money, more money that we don't have and we're borrowing from the Chinese. We have to make the decisions to reduce the federal budget. 